Today, Kevin and Andrew and I are gonna be trying an assortment of foods from Rebecca Ruth. Now, Rebecca Ruth is a, um, a candy company, a chocolate company in Kentucky, and uh, I did a whole, um, uh, like a vlog about it, uh, a video about it, and so if you want to look that up, you can. We took a tour, and it was really interesting uh, to get to see where this candy's made. Uh, this is the mixed fudge. It is chocolate and peanut butter, and so you get two chocolate and two peanut butter. And then in here, um, I have two different chocolates. I'll talk about those in a few minutes. And then we bought some cream candy, but what I want to show you right now is the Derby Pop. Um, and the reason I want to show this to you now is because you have to actually open these. Uh, it says for best results, preheat oven and bake at 350 for 10 to 12 minutes. Tart is fully baked and best served warm. So I'm going to open it right now so you can see what you get. This is a Derby pie. Um, it is exclusively baked by Carnes Kitchen in Louisville, Kentucky. Um, it says to store it in the freezer. The lady there told us we could store it in the refrigerator. So that's where we have had it in the refrigerator. So this is how it looks. And uh, it's a little ugly thing right now, but it won't be when it comes out. So I'm just going to put, I'm going to put, I bought two. So I'm going to put both of these on the baking, uh, baking pan. Um, it says it has, um, the whole thing is 420 calories. Um, and Kevin and I made a Derby pie just recently, so we wanted to see how it compared, uh, to our, uh, our Derby pie. So we'll be able to tell you which one is the best. It is a chocolate nut tart. Um, I have, uh, two little Derby pies. Um, I, we bought two. I went ahead and made them, forgetting that Andrew's not supposed to have walnuts. They have walnuts. So, it's okay. You heat them up. They're here. So, that's Derby Pie. And then we have cream candy. Cool cream candy. And it was, for the two pieces, it was $2.32 a piece. So, over... Yeah, eight over, piece or each? Or for both? For both of these, it was $2.32. So, so, so $1.16 a, a piece. A piece. Okay, and Andrew, what do you have? $1.16 a piece, Lord of mercy. Okay, it's I have... It's not cheap. Rebecca Ruth chocolates. I have mixed fudge, chocolate, and peanut butter. So you're looking at $7. $7 for four, four, pieces, four, 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 four pieces. It's all pieces handmade. of chocolate. It's handmade. We even took the tour if you if you watched that video. Or is it up? I said that, no, I said that. Okay. It's up. I said um, that when I was making And then these are, we, uh, we bought two of their holiday uh, flavors. This is the, uh, we're pretty sure one of them is a gingerbread, gingerbread cake ball. And the other one is an eggnog uh, candy. It's okay, you'll like the gingerbread one. You don't like eggnog? He, I don't, I don't like eggnog. eggnog when it's chilled, when I have my chilled mug. When you got a big glass you of it might, about this big. You might really I have like a chilled, it. I put the mug in the freezer and chill She it. drinks eggnog like me, a glass, not a shot uh, glass. A huge, but, but he, I have, he but might it's really like, like I don't do it like every day though. Yeah, I don't want, you know. I haven't drank eggnog. But eggnog is like enough. pure fat, right? Yeah, it is. It's <laughs> bad. If you bad. watch the video, though, they have this huge candy counter, and it all looks fantastic. It does look And really you real. can't go in there and not buy something. You're just overwhelmed by the smells and the sights, and you have to buy some stuff. So I, we chose to buy the two seasonal items. Those were the only seasonal items that they offered. So... Uh, what, let's try... Jump into the cake and get that out of Are the you way. sure you yes. don't want to try... Okay. Just dive into the cake, guys. Okay, this is the Derby Pie, and it has a uh, chocolate uh, and walnuts, and uh, like I said earlier, Kevin and I did one of these for a, an actual video, and I wanted to see if I thought these... <laughs> um. <laughs> I wanted to see if I thought these were as... Why this you just pick up the whole ours. thing and take a bite out of it? Mm. There's nothing like what we made. <laughs> is it better? Mm -hmm. Or is it worse? It's it just doesn't have the chocolate in it like ours did. Ours is like a big cookie. This is that like is, almost all walnuts. That's awesome. That's all and he walnuts. He said it's all walnuts. Yeah, you could have taken that. You could have taken a bite and go, Bleh. Yeah. <laughs> well, no. I mean, it's just it's like. That I want to eat more so bad, but I know, Kevin, oh. we have so much to try. Shh. We have That's just young one. My, I just wanted to see. There's there is chocolate on the bottom. It's delicious. 
it but it's is not delicious. a lot of chocolate on the top. It's, it's quite. If it's really we good. could have done ours like this, if we had added more than once. So if you take the same derby pie that we made and, and like put in twice walnuts. as many alt walnuts, <laughs> yeah. you could make that same thing. That was really good. But it's very strong walnut. So. Okay, let's try the cream candy. You know, I see this. They sell this at Walgreens right here. Uh, they sell those uh, those big derby pies, those huge derby pies, in Kroger. When yeah, it's the same ones, they're just bigger. Yeah, the brand is uh, Carl's. Uh, are they actually made in? Right you know? when you go, with, yeah, they're made in Frankfurt. These are? Uh, or Louisville. <clears throat> they're made in Louisville, it says on the front. Right when you go in the door of Kroger, they sell those. But we never knew that those were the same ones. Hey, you're supposed to store that in the freezer. I know, but we asked her, remember? We yeah, said, she said it was good for like two weeks, two or okay. three weeks. Take your piece. This is just pure sugar. I'm sorry. I don't care for that. I'm sorry you paid three dollars for that. <laughs> that tastes like a communion wafer. I've had really, really, really good cream candy. I have too. And I don't like that. It tastes like a communion wafer. It, it has like a weird water. flavor. Yeah, that wasn't good. It's like I licked a box. Yeah, that was not good. I, I don't know why. So that's disappointing. That did not have a good flavor. At all. Okay. The texture was really good. It was good and, and creamy and stuff. But, but you know, you took a gamble. We the took it. Yeah. Not at all. Okay. We're saving you guys your money. So. What's funny is they're known for their bourbon balls and candy. They don't even want to come out of there. Right. Look, that no neither. They don't want to come out. Okay. If there's anybody out there that lives in Kentucky and, and has Rebecca Roof is eating their cream candy and like it, maybe you can explain why you like that. <laughs> it's just some peanut butter. Hold on. I'm trying to get it. It's very stuck I, on all. Maybe I should have put it in the refrigerator, but they didn't have it refrigerated. Uh -huh. They had it sitting out. Okay. I wholeheartedly mean this. I like yours better. No. Oh. I like yours way better. It's good. It's sweet. It's everything you'd expect from peanut butter fudge. It doesn't have the crunchy nuts in there or anything like that. It doesn't so have I, the flavor. So I liked it. But it doesn't have the near the flavor that yours does. No. The flavor is not there at all. This is the chocolate. I agree with you. I just like the fact that there's no nuts. I thought you like peanuts in yours. Mm -mm. I like it to be smooth. I like to yeah, flatten it out with my tongue and taste it. I don't like that one. Mm -mm. That has a weird after place. I don't like that at all. Well, good. I'll take them home. You can take them home. I'll eat them right now. You and Christina can enjoy them. You can, yeah. yeah. No, Christina will take them. Um, <laughs> I, yeah, I did not. Um, yeah, she can eat that little stuff. <laughs> he can take the cream candy. Um, I, I said, that's cream candy. I didn't enjoy really any of that so far. No. Well, so let's try the eggnog. Yeah. I don't know which one's which. We, yeah, we, let me just. I'll tell you which one's which by the smell. Once she cuts it, they're big guys. I'll fix that. This is a eggnog. I really didn't cut it very well. No, it's okay. No, I got, I got my piece. Yeah. That, I would think, well, I don't know. That's chocolate looking too. You want me to cut one of the other ones because that's such a small piece. I'm sorry. I didn't do a good job. Or here, take a big piece. Just, no, give me the small one. No, 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 no. I don't no. like this bread. Mm. God, it's so good. Well, Andrew, eat wow. half of it. Here, take it in there. Yeah, that's definitely gingerbread. <laughs> that's good. <laughs> I'm a tired gingerbread fan. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's a, it's good gingerbread, but do you think that's eggnog? It's, it's brown. That is good gingerbread. Um, I don't well, know. Well, this will be another gingerbread. Oh, you don't know? I don't know. Wait, wait. That's wait, gingerbread. Wait, I don't think that's eggnog. Mm -hmm. I don't think that's eggnog. I think that's gingerbread again. I think you go well, the they, they all look the same. I can't help it. Okay, this should be eggnog. Like, you think that's eggnog? That's weird. It kind of like peach ones. Eat that. Maybe it's different. Somebody eat that. Maybe it is an eggnog. Y'all might not know. I, I've, I've eaten so much gingerbread. I ate almost it's all of it. different flavor. That's not. That's like a pecan type deal. That tastes like a like a really. That's really good. I really like that. It tastes like molasses. I don't know what the. They they grabbed the wrong chocolate for you. 
So it seems like it tastes like molasses. That did not taste like what we just tried. No, that's not, that's not, that should have been a gingerbread. Okay, let's try this one. That should be gingerbread. Oh, you think it's gingerbread? Yeah, smell it. You can smell. I think it's gingerbread. So that eggnoggy thing was was that second thing we ate, and it didn't taste anything like. Well, cut that one just to make sure. Is it? Yeah. I'm sorry, we're eating a lot of chocolate in front of us. We can't figure it out. Hmm. Now that has a little white on the inside. It probably has a wall on it. <laughs> mm -mm. No, it doesn't. Mm. No, I'll tell you if it does. That said white, not one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not that bad. That's gingerbread. That's really good gingerbread. I like the gingerbread. I um, like the other weird thing. I, like I absolutely no. adore the derby pie. The derby pie. The is derby pie is really phenomenal. good. What's funny is the derby pie is not actually made by Ruth Hunt. We're <laughs> <laughs> Re Re sorry, Rebecca Ray. Rebecca Ray. It's not made by Rebecca Ray. It's Rue. not made by Rebecca Ray. Yeah. So, me personally, I did not like one thing Rebecca Ruth made that we bought. Not really. I mean, the gingerbread. The gingerbread was fine, but I wouldn't buy it again. No. I wouldn't buy any of it. It's just too it's out of my price range. It's to too begin expensive. With. But I enjoyed eating it. Now the derp but the derby pie the derby pies I awesome. would get the derby pie again and knowing that they have them right when you walk in the door at Kroger, yeah, just go I would buy a big one of those uh for the family and just Aner just wouldn't get any. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed getting to see those and hear about those and thanks for watching.